What's up crossover fam? We're back with another reaction video and this time we're taking a look at A to Z's fake TikTok dentist just got humbled by the law. So apparently there's some fake TikTok dentists doing some things on TikTok. They can believe they're dentists. So we're definitely going to check this out and react to this, uh, this video here. But before we do so, make sure we smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, turn on all notifications. And definitely leave a comment on the video. Let me know what to react to next. And let's get on with it. Let's see. Let's see what we got going on here. The fake TikTok dentists are now in complete shambles as the most popular one of them just got arrested. So meet Brandon Dillard, AKA Ayla Smiles Atlanta. You might recognize him from my last video on these R fake TikTok dentists titled, Never heard these, of these TikTokers fake are TikTok running an dentists. illegal dentist scam. And what do you know? I gotta really? give it to my past self. That thumbnail aged extremely well. My videos don't always age great. This one definitely did I've, though. I've never I heard of it. Uh... I was kind of like, huh, am I being a bit hyperbolic here? Well, I don't know. I might, but these guys I've never are probably heard going of, to jail. Uh, and I've never heard of these fake TikTok dentists. So I'm I'm way out of the loop with this one. Let me know in the comments if uh, you guys heard of these fake TikTok dentist people. Here we are. So what happened? Well, there's been a horrifying trend on TikTok and Instagram mainly referred to as veneer talk. And here you have a group really? of uh, shady entrepreneurs who just decided to skip dental school and go straight to drilling away on innocent people's teeth wow. that just don't know minute. better. And unfortunately, wait, wait, they're going wait, wait, wait. viral on Instagram and TikTok with videos they just take right after doing the procedures. And of wow. course, they charge a fraction of the price as the licensed dentists. So. So these people are actually doing some work on people and just doing it for like half off the price. That That's insane. Would you guys go to a, a fake dentist and some TikTok dentist and get this done? Let me know. People who just don't know better, they think they're getting a great deal, except many are setting themselves up for a lifetime of pain. In oh, my wow. last video, we actually covered someone who literally now has a lifetime of pain after going to a dentist place like this, because clearly they cut a whole lot of corners to do this procedure at a fraction of the price, like dental school. Things are so bad that these TikTok veneer technicians are doing these two day courses to learn how to drill away on people's teeth. And on the advertisement for these courses, they say, hey, mimosas are included. There's really these little courses and <laughs> they got mimosas. Nothing this, like drinking rosé while learning how to work on people's teeth for only. Wow. Let's uh, let's drink and eat, be merry, but not even learn how to really do this dentist stuff. Only two days. You know, that's exactly the medical background I want for someone who's drilling away on two my days, teeth. Two so days for drilling on teeth. These, entrepreneurs are starting to get arrested but i mean the funniest thing about them Great. is how brazen they are because this is recklessly stupid like they deserve to get caught when they're this brazen about it and these people this are just straight insane, up committing man. felonies in every single social media post to attract more customers so they can then make more money off of this is more really films. insane it is man. just one big negative feedback loop and downward spiral for them but i guess we're here for it because it seems like they will actually get consequences for this I mean, her teeth don't look bad. Rolly's new smile. 213,000 wow. likes on this video. No wonder he's going to jail. 200,000 likes. Wait, how many views did this get? That has yeah, to at least crazy. be like three to four million views. So who would ever want to commit a felony and have three to four million people see it? Especially at this, this is scale. This is I love insane. All the top comment is guess who's going to jail tonight. It's so... This is crazy. <laughs> So they're just doing this. People are just like, yeah, let me just get my teeth done by these people. And <laughs> they're going to have some consequences at the end. Such a ridiculous trend. But hey, here we are. And there's so many of these people here who don't even have bad teeth. Like this woman right here. She doesn't need veneers. Yeah. Well, there's that's... not a big difference between her before and after there what her, her teeth in the first picture there perfectly fine she yeah. has better teeth Looks, than me <laughs> yeah that's it those, <laughs> those teeth look great veneers. wow what but now you have this dumbass who's permanently altered her teeth and then of course of course he was doing the, the training now. courses as well which we previously covered here we go a-list two two day veneer training material and gifts 
a vendor lifts taught by the CEO himself. Wow. You get a full veneer kit. Oh, no. A live model practice. Oh, no. So oh, it says no. limited availability, two-day veneer training course. I mean, this is recent. It's August. Wow. And discover the secrets to creating aesthetic smile design and composite This veneers. is insane, man. Full kit included. Liability waivers and insurance. Yeah, how, is, how, how is this even allowed, man? Like, getting the train, two-day training, and you're, and you're in? That's it? You can do it. Then support group chat, vendors list, hands-on training, and live models. And again, wow. the top comment is, and y'all are going to jail. I mean, he's here <laughs> in 4K yeah, y'all going to jail, teaching man. this class, posting on his own social media course. And apparently they charge like $6,000 for this two-day course. Imagine paying $6,000 to someone to then learn to go out there and commit felonies. It's cold world That is there. crazy. Also, because of these 6K. stupid courses, this is sadly just an epidemic of these morons doing these practices due to how profitable this is. As these procedures, they cost yeah, thousands this is really of dollars. Insane. And these composite veneers that they're inserting into people's mouth can literally be bought on Timu. I'm not joking. Hence why the American Dental Association wow. now came out with a massive warning about these scammers. The only problem is, who knows someone who checks on the American Dental Association's website? I don't know. Yeah, are you guys going to his website to find out who's, who's a real dentist or not? De I'm definitely not. That's for sure. A single soul. I didn't know about the website until I researched this video. So lads, this is my calling. Hmm. Clearly, the American Dental Association, they have a message and it's not getting to the people because these people have way too many clients. Yeah, there's, so clearly, there's this too many people is here. not getting to the people. This is, How do we this make this information accessible? Let's stick up some absolutely cracked Subway Surfer gameplay over here while I read this little snippet. As dentists, <laughs> our mission is to deliver quality care that promotes oral and overall health as well as build trust with patients we humbly serve in our communities, said ADA President Linda J. Wow. Edgar. Dental procedures that are considered irreversible should only be performed by a licensed trained dentist. The public should be extreme. Now, are you also getting sidetracked with the Subway Surfer uh, a video here? Because I'm definitely not paying attention to what he's saying. I'm paying attention to the Subway Surfing. Extremely cautious of these purported offerings. Dental treatment from unlicensed individuals has the potential to cause damaging complications for patients, according to the ADA statement. Any dental procedure that may alter the physical structure of an individual's teeth, gum, or jaws without supervision of a dentist has the potential to cause is irreversible harm. Dentistry is a regulated yeah, healthcare profession that necessitates formal education and licensure, the ADA said. Each state has dental, regulations man. that require dentists and hygienists to be licensed in order to provide patient care. All right, so with that in so, mind, these so how people, these people have essentially licenses? snitched on themselves to get more clients, to scam, and then make more money. They're going to jail. Shout out criminals oh, for they being are so stupid in 2024, they will just happily document their own crimes just for some simple clout and money. And speaking of which, the main guy that we're talking about today, Brandon from Ala Smiles Atlanta, is being charged with eight Hopefully felonies, he's going to jail, including man. practicing yep. dentistry oh, without a license, felonies, yep. practicing bye medicine bye. without a license, and theft by deception. Get absolute bodied. Karma is in fact he's, a real he's thing. Done what goes around comes around. It might just take a little time. Dunzos, because man. when I was making my last videos on these guys, I was sitting here like, how are these people so brazen about this they're so public with their felonies but none of them have been arrested yet like how are these people not in jail yeah i, I guess this, that changed now happened? but since i made my last video the fulton county da offices came out and confirmed that there is no such thing legally as a veneer specialist or a veneer technician these are just complete Adam, bs made just up making up stories that these scammers are using to try to give themselves credibility because they Insane. didn't go to dental school is not a dentist and never has been and they say he's been putting patients at risk yeah got him look at that got him he, patients at risk not even a dentist this is insane man these are the eight felony criminal warrants investigators still there at this hour they call this operation toothache and a deputy operation district toothache. attorney figured out what was going on That's here a by great seeing name, a viral TikTok. Investigators raided what looks like a high-end dental practice in Northeast Atlanta. I'm actually so happy they caught this guy then because some of the people we covered in the last videos, they were doing it in hotel rooms 
or just random offices. Like they didn't actually have professional looking dental. This guy has so a I understand professional how he looking people, thing. Especially being that big on Instagram and TikTok, which was his main platform. To his 157,000 Instagram followers, Brandon Dillard promoted himself as Atlanta's top veneer specialist and crazy. trainer. But he's not showing off that expensive smile in this booking photo on eight felony charges, including practicing dentistry and medicine without a license and theft by deception. Is Brandon Dillard a dentist brandon dillard is not a dentist he's never been a dentist um and as Get much as he may want to play one on instagram he is not one fulton county district attorney fonnie willis tells me only licensed dentists can do this kind of work in georgia but dillard has been operating here for years in plain sight That's if insane. you went to this and you thought it was a dental office and you looked at the equipment it's insane how he got away with this for so long that's what yeah, the that's, best fraudsters do. they were saying. enticing people to come in to take these classes so that you could it's just crazy that you can get fooled by this. Just go in there, get it for half off, and let's work on your teeth. Get rich too, but you are getting rich doing something that's completely illegal. Patients showing up here expecting to oh, have no way. work instead found police. They say that people don't have a license and they're just arresting them all. You, 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 huh? you a blood clotter. Where my money at? What you talking about? Um, that is saved. Those <laughs> people are so lucky. They're showing up to pay money. They, actually, they probably paid a deposit. So it sucks they lost yeah. their deposit. Lost their I mean, deposit. They have to wait and go through court and all that crap to get that back. But that's what she's tight. They won't have permanently altered teeth for the rest of their life. Patients yeah. are not only the victims of monetary fraud. She was but tight. She lost that money, man. Here too. We have had dentists not just locally, but from outside of the state also come and report that they were concerned about their patients hmm. who had received services at this location. Yeah, there were people the getting term effects of veneers damages. on top of tooth decay, which is a massive. Wow, that's issue. crazy. I'm torn on, top on that of tooth decay. I feel like at some point you would. You would know you're doing something wrong if you can do a two-day course and think that you can just operate on people's teeth. While you might yeah, be a victim care. for Brandon, you're also a victim of your own stupidity. That's for sure. <laughs> so how do you spot these scammers? Yeah, Those he always has some, obvious, but some since quick these people words, are literally man. rocking around with Rolex presidentials, there's clearly a lot of people falling for these scams. And by just looking at their social media pages, they have a lot of clients. The first red flag, uh, the lack of dental degree. If you see a congratulations, you finished your two day veneer tech course with mimosas included plaque on the wall, run. If yeah. they want to work Get on out. you in a hotel room, run. If they make themselves look super legit, like this scumbag Brandon, Google dentist license lookup. If their name doesn't yeah. show up on that website, run. And it's not one set website. This is why I'm saying Google it because each state has their individual .gov website where you can go look that up. Well, this is just one big game of whack-a-mole <laughs> because now they have this guy, Dental Daddy, who we previously covered. He's still running around. Then you have the sketchy clinic in Florida who did the influencer Winter's Teeth, who we also covered. They're still operating from what I can tell. Oh, wow. So, I mean, it's, a, it's safe to say There's this a whole, whole bunch of people that a mess, yeah, take a look at this. Hopefully, It'll get better. But just like WSB stated, the Fulton County District Attorney is looking for people who are clients or students of this guy. So if you're unfortunate enough that that's actually you, here's the email to reach out to them. And wow. I'm sorry that Fault happened tips to you. So this is a clear takeaway. Go to an actual dentist. I know dentistry yeah. is stupidly expensive yeah, here in the US, to, go, but from go looking to a dentist, at the cases man. we've seen, the people- go, go to a dentist. Don't go to a half off service. You know, some fake dentist here. People who thought they were saving money by going to a fake dentist ended up spending way more at a real dentist fixing the damage this first fake dentist caused. So you I guess that's just some food spend for thought. Spending extra money for here, no reason. Feel free to subscribe. Drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it. And also, we're doing a limited edition run over at Matt.City for all of October for our Halloween collection. So if you want another way to support the channel, check out Matt.City and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Yeah, man. So that'll do it for this react video. I can't believe people are really going to these TikTok dentist people and thinking that they're uh, going to get something, you know, for half off and, and great. But definitely hit the like on the stream. Subscribe to the channel. Turn on all notifications. Let me know in the comments what other uh, react videos or whatever other videos you want me to react to. We'll definitely catch you on the next one, man. Peace.